Hello everyone, this is Sherwin here from TechOS, and today I'm going to be taking a look at the new Notes app in OS X. Now, Apple have added a few new features to the Notes app to make it more interesting and useful for, um, obviously, users of OS X. So, in this video, I'm going to be creating a sort of demo um, note on a camping holiday. This is not actually a real thing, so that's just something you should know. Um, so I'm going to go through the main features. So this is going to be a camping holiday. So I'm going to be writing a list of things I need to take. So I'm just going to start by typing in my title. So I'm going to type in camping holiday things to pack. And if I highlight this, if I go to the top here to this little text button, if I click on that, it gives me a list of sort of various formatting options I can use. If I click title, it makes it into a nice big title, and obviously I can go ahead and underline that just like that. I can do that easily by going up to where is it? Edit, um, sorry, not edit format, and I can choose the various options I can go here and I've got all my formatting options here I've got my justification and I can obviously use those other options if I want to now I'm going to hit enter a couple of times and I'm going to add an image now behind here I have got a image of the place I'm going to be going to this campsite and so I'm just going to take this full screen or oh, not full screen, I'm going to use a split, split screen view you can check out my video on that now over here it's not letting me use mail in full screen so I'm just going to have to live without that for now sorry not mail, notes so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to drag this image to notes and as you can see as well as inputting my image it is also put in a nice little thumbnail for me at the top here now I want to be able to refer, to, I'm going to be sharing this note to others so I want to be able to make it easy for them to get details so I'm just going to slide here if I go to the top of my address bar I can actually click and drag this link over into my note and as you can see it adds a sort of little information thumbnail um, based on that website and that's a nice feature that there is. Oh, don't know what I've done there, but doesn't matter. So now I'm going to start writing my checklist of things to pack. Now this is a new feature I can do. So if I want to type things like tent, tent, pegs. Um, sorry, I don't need a hyphen there. Um, if I want to add something else, so say if I want to bring my gas stove and my gas cylinder. Now this is all good having this like this and I can obviously just add um, my um, bullet points like that if I wanted to however the new notes app oh, provides a much better way of doing this of sort of creating checklists so in previous versions of notes you would have to obviously get delete things as you've done them however or just use the reminders app however I highlight everything and click up here on this little checklist item as you can see it will now make each item a checklist and the good great thing about these is that I can just um, tick them off as I do them so that's a nice feature to have and yeah now I'm going to go down and I'm just going to add some uh, more info info and I'm just going to underline that and I'm just going to change the style to heading I'm just going to click enter and there's some in information here I want to copy so I'm just going to take copy that info and paste it in there. Now, as you see notes is, is got smarter now let me just learn this and so if I hover my mouse over the date um, this will 
I mean, notes will recognize that this is a date for clicking this arrow. It will prompt me to quick look it so I can see if there's anything else in my calendar. Or I can also oh, click on the arrow, I can show this date in the calendar. So we'll just open up my calendar and from here I can just choose whether I want to add an, uh, an event. However, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to go here, quick click event, and I can just click add to calendar. And there you go, it would have added it to my calendar. So now I will have got an event in my calendar, and I can just obviously get reminded that I've got to this event um, whenever it has been scheduled for, scheduled, or whichever way you want to set, depending on which country you are. I'm trying to serve as many people here, but yeah, that doesn't really matter. So yeah, that was a quick look at the new Notes app in OS X El Capitan. If you have any questions or comments on anything in this video, you can send me an email or you get in contact with me in any other way. Obviously drop a comment below this video, that will get you straight through to me. Because I get an email from Google every time someone comments on my video, but you really don't need to know that. But anyway, that's it for today. Um, I'll have my next video up hopefully tomorrow and I think I'll be moving on to iOS 9 so if you're looking forward to iOS 9 videos stay tuned for more videos. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.